What's up you guys, it's Jono. Welcome to another episode of Pokemon Legends Arceus. Today I wanna to show you how you can get Magikarp as early as possible in the game. If you're trying to get a Gyarados just like me, then this is gonna be your best bet. You can get this pretty much as soon as you learn how to dodge, the dodge that does a little dive thing. As soon as you have that move available, you can run right over here on the world map and you can find a Magikarp. Now you'll recognize this location because there is a giant Staraptor that is just flying around. And also, if you jump in the water, absolutely nothing happens. They just put you back on the shore where you were, so there's really no consequence for jumping in the water. So this method is foolproof, and you can get a Magikarp with absolutely no consequence. So go ahead and do this method. It's actually really funny, and it's really hilarious that this even works. If you look down there, you'll notice it's a really, really, really high drop-off, but you can slowly kind of jump down little ledge by ledge, and there's a little island right down there. You can see that island. Magikarp spawns right off of that island. There's actually a couple of places where you can do this but I thought this one was the best because it was really easy to just jump down here now if you guys don't know me and if you don't know anything about me I am like a crazy explorer and I love climbing mountains and finding hidden stuff and getting stuff as early as you possibly can by just running around and getting to places you're not supposed to be able to be just yet so this is what I did here I basically just moved around until I was able to get where I wanted to get and then I saw the Magikarp and I was just waiting for him to get closer to me so I could actually catch him this is a really really fun way to do it I had a blast doing this I was so excited that I was able to pull it off and that's why I decided to make this video for you guys now you can see you can throw the balls really really far it actually wasn't that hard to throw the balls he's moving around he's pretty far out there but I can hit him so at least I got a way to get this done I'm gonna throw some berries out there or at least I thought I was gonna throw some berries out there but he did eventually swim really close to me and I thought you know what let's just forget the berry and I'll nail him with a pokeball it's Magikarp after all he shouldn't be that hard to catch and as you can see here he was really not hard to catch whatsoever Ever. And there we go, you guys. We got our very first Magikarp. This was like so early in the game. I was shocked that I was able to do it. I don't have any kind of a swimming Pokemon, and I don't have any way to get down here aside from just my own creative ingenuity. Now, some people would say, Jono, you're stuck. Once you jump in the water, you're never going to be able to get off of this island because it's just going to teleport you right back to the island. Well, those people would be wrong because remember, you can fast travel anywhere. You can even fast travel when you're inside buildings to outside buildings. So I'm just going to fast travel myself right back to camp and we are good to go. We got ourselves a Magikarp and it was super easy and it was actually pretty fun too, I got to admit. So anyway, you guys, that is the little tutorial here. You can get Magikarp super quick, super early, super easy. So I'm really happy about that. I hope you guys found this video informative. I hope you guys like the information here. I am planning on shiny hunting a Magikarp and I'm even going to shiny hunt the Gyarados that is flying around up above the mountain. I cannot wait to do those experiences as well. But if you're just trying to get a super quick Magikarp really early in the game, then this is the way to do it. All you need is that dodge feature and that's what you need. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you found it informative. Please smack the like button and drop me a comment down below. Thank you to my amazing subscribers and peace.